Images by Clark Ashton Smith Narrated by Matthew Schmitz Tears Thy tears are not as mine. Thou weepest as a green fountain among palms and roses with lightly falling drops that bedew the flowery turf. My tears are like a rain of Mara in the desert, leaving a bitter pool whose waters are fire and poison. The Secret Rose My soul hath dreamt of a rose, whose marvelous and secret flower fraught with an unimaginable perfume, hath never grown in any garden. Only in valleys of the shifting cloud, only among the palms and fountains of a land of mirage, only in isles beyond the seas of sunset, it blooms for a moment and is gone. But ever the ghost of its fragrance haunts the hall of slumber, and the women whom I meet in dreams wear always its blossom for coral. The Wind and the Garden To thee, my love, is something strange and fantastical and far away, like the vast and desolate sighing of the desert wind to one who dwells in a garden of palm and rose and lotus, filled by no louder sound than the mellow lisp of a breeze of perfume or the sigh of silvering fountains. Offerings Before thee, O goddess of my dreams, idol of my desires, I have burnt amber and myrrh, frankincense, and all the strange and rich perfumes of lands a thousand leagues beyond Araby or Taprobane. Strange and rich offerings have I brought thee, the gems of unknown regions and the spoil of cities remoter than Kadon or Samarkand. But these delight thee not. Only the simple scented flowers of string and the diamonds and opals of dew strung on the threads of the spider. A Coronal The pale flowerous poppies of Prosperine, the cold blind lotus of Lethe, and the strange white sea blooms that glow from the lips of drowned men in the blue darkness of the nether sea. These have woven as the coronal for my dead love.